The first thing we'll want to do to use Panopto is we need to add it to our pilot course. This is essentially going to give all of our videos a place to reside within pilot. To do that, log into pilot at pilot.write.edu. And once you're logged in, you can navigate to your course. Here, courses are divided up by semester, or you might already have your courses pinned here um, in the All tab. Um, but find the course you want to add it to and click that course. Once you're here, you'll navigate to the content area. And then you'll want to go on this left side of the table of contents and click in this add a module text box to create a module for Panopto. So we can call this um, anything that the students uh, can understand quickly. So I would just call it video lectures if that's what you're using. If you're using it for supplemental videos, you can call it that. Um, but type in the name of the module and hit return or enter on your keyboard. Now once the module has been created, uh, what you can do is go to this Add Existing Activities button. And if you already have a lot of modules, um, then you may have to scroll up a little bit to see this button in your newly added module. But um, in this module, click Add Existing Activities, then choose External Learning Tools. This is just a collection of third-party tools that all integrate into Pilot. And this is listed alphabetically. So you'll just scroll down until you see Panopto. Go ahead and click Panopto. And this is our link to where the videos will reside. You'll want to click this link. And so once you click this, here you should see the embedded Panopto window. So this is the embedded Panopto window where your videos will be recorded. You'll come here to do all your recording of videos. Um, and then this is also where students will come in Pilot to watch the videos that you've recorded. Now, if you don't see this, you might have a page telling you that cookies are not enabled. That's OK. You can just scroll down, and there should be an option to uh, open it in a new window um, so that it can be created even without cookies. You'll see that the name of the folder that's created is the name of your course. So it will prepin the semester, fall 2019, and your course number and section. So here I'm in GE 105001, General Education 1, and it just creates a folder in Panopto specifically for this course section.